welcome back to another episode of Combat Step. We are about to proceed to combat, but before we move phases, please like and let us know in the comments which deck you're cheering for. Deck lists are in the description below. Before we delve into the depths of the multiverse, continue supporting our channel in its quest to bring you more thrilling content. By becoming a patron supporter, you'll gain access to exclusive perks and help us continue to create top-notch videos. Be sure to use our Dragon Shield and Ink Gaming affiliate links in the description when you purchase your next set of products. Don't forget to follow us on social media and stay updated on the latest news, deck techs, and community discussions. And of course, make sure to subscribe to our channel to join the ever-growing community of fellow Planeswalkers. With your support, we'll continue to explore the boundless possibilities of Magic the Gathering together. Alright, good luck everybody. Yes, good, sir, luck. good luck, have fun. fun Alright, on tap up to draw. Play a Marsh Flats as my land for turn. And after that, I'm just gonna pass the turn. Draw. Hollowed Fountain. Yeah, I'll just have it. I'm gonna go on tap to two. Lotus Petal. Mox Opal. Do one. Soul Ring. And then two Talisman of Indulgence, two for a Talisman of Progress. Dockside's eating good today, ladies yeah, and gentlemen. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I'll just pass turn. <laughs> I'm playing uh, City of Brass and then taking a damage to play a Carrying Feeder, and I'll pass the turn. On tap, upkeep, and draw. I'm going to Baldwin's Tomb. I'm going to remove two of my life points for the tapping for a soul ring. And then I would like to tap the soul ring, if that's good, for a grim monolith. Guys, you're making me so hungry for a dark side. <laughs> <laughs> uh, with that, I will pass that. Um, I would like to fetch on an end step. We'll just grab a use. Right, I will untap upkeep draw. That is kind of sad to see. But I guess if everyone's doing it, I'll do it, and I'll feed a dark side too. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. And I will just pass a turn with one, two, three, four, five, six, seven cards in hand. Rosh. I'll do Misty Rainforest. Fetch. I'll do an Unicorn. All right. Untap. I'll keep and draw. I will play a Spire Garden, which will come in untapped unless um, anybody would like to concede due to my dominance over here. Let's do it, nope. Jane. You ready? <laughs> <laughs> and I'm going to pay two, and I'll take a damage from the City of Brass, going at 38, to play a Sylvan Library. Um, Sylvan Library is good. I will pass turn. Untap, upkeep, and a drop. Yeah, I will pass turn. Uh oh, that stinks. You kept a hand with no colored mana? That's risky. <laughs> you still yeah. got more mana than me. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I will untap upkeep draw. Tap my underground C for a dark ritual. Yes, pass on dark ritual. Use two of it to put a witch claw talisman on the stack. Link in response to the wish claw. I'll attempt to nause. I think we uh, are gonna have to force a will pitching Pollywog, Frog Wizard. Ooh, the frog. Alright, it will enter with three counters, put an activation on the stack. I will tutor for a card. Uh, let's see. And then with the resolution of Wish Claw, I almost want to give it to Brea simply because Dockside is worse for Brea than everybody else at the table. That is true, yeah. <clears throat> but I also kind of dared to give it to Brea because they're also next in turn order. Well, if one of them got a dog, that's a Dockside, and they make. Eight, nine treasures or seven oh, treasures? Yeah. Don't blame I me. At upkeep, if you give it to me. What's that? <laughs> I'll go get Taiga at upkeep. <laughs> <laughs> oh. I think my safest option 
just because of Darkseid threat is to go ahead and give it to Brea. I might regret this, Makes but sense. that is going to be my decision. Okay. Um, I think it's probably the safest decision you, you know. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. I would like to pass a Lotus Petal as I will pass the turn. On your own step. Uh-oh. Uh -oh. Um, take one Allsman. I'll flash in an Orcish Bellman. ETB on the stack works one, and I'm going to ping the Aryan Feeder. If it dies, poor little guy. I'm going to play a Brea. ETB, she will make two spotters. I am going to do one and activate the Wish Claw, but I'm going to maintain priority and do two and sacrifice a Thopter and the Wish Claw Talisman. Okay, so it goes to my grave. Yeah. Ew, cruel. I think uh, no one to really food, so I'll probably do the option no one expects, I'll just gain up life. If that's good, I'm going to search for a card and I'll pass them. I'll untap, I'll draw my card, and then I'll draw the two for Sylvan Library. With uh, an Orcish Bowmasters on the field, are you? Where the Bowmaster I mean, trigger is going to go if I draw the cards? Yeah, someone's face. <laughs> Am I probably, probably There's probably no creatures for me to kill. Are you going to point at my face? I'm, I'm, I'm T and K, so it's probably mine. Are you pointing? Will you point them at Captain? I'll more than at the. I'll more than likely point them at Captain because he is on at odds. Yep. So we have three Bowmaster triggers. Are they all coming my way? Yeah, I'll point them both at your face. Of course. One, two. And I will. Three of them. Take eight and feel great. I'll go to thirty. <laughs> Boop. And then live your best life, bro. Yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna continue though. Hurt myself, punch myself. I'm gonna play a verdant catacombs and I would like to crack it. I will go get a badlands for I'm gonna tap for my three colors and I will again continue to punch myself to cast Slimefoot and Squee. If Slimefoot and Squee is good, he'll have an ETB trigger to bring in a sapperling. Pass the turn there, seven cards in hand. Tap, but keep a drop. Pass turn. No. No, 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 no. no. Oh tap, well. Upkeep, good to draw. I will crack Lotus Petal for a red. Tap for a bl black. And put a Dockside on the stack. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> Hold on. Oh, no. Hit, damn! <laughs> yeah. We're in that, danger. That's... Yeah. yeah, it doesn't matter for me. I will not crack my Lotus Petal. <laughs> All right. Dockside ETB on the stack. I just vomited a yep. little bit in my mouth. <laughs> yep. Uh, it was 10, correct? Yeah. Mm -hmm. I would like to use three of them going down to seven and put a Rhystic Study on the stack. I will use another three going down to four and we are going to put some spice on the stack. Brina. Ooh. I think I'm going to use three more. Go down to one treasure. And put a Timna on the stack. And uh, I will pass a turn. That's strong. Two for a Falwar Stone. Do I increase the Dox I count? Uh, Rhystic Study. Uh, you can draw. And, yep, I will draw. Orcus yep. Masters. Yep. You mentioned not getting rid of your dog side, <laughs> so I'm going to attempt to ping Timna. Okay, nope, Timna's good. I it, Unless you have a clone, I would argue for you getting rid of dog side just so nobody else can clone it. Attempt to do a Wheel of Fortune. And clear the whole board. <laughs> 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 I will Deadly Rollick the OBM. I will decline my Rhystic Trigger. Yep, I'm fine with that happening. Um, so with the will on the stack, I would like to crack my last treasure for a blue. And I would like to cast a Mystical Tutor. And then does the wheel resolve? Yep, and then I will be passing priority on the wheel. 
Okay, so we're discarding and drawing seven. Yep. Notable yeah. card for me is Food Chain and Twin Flame. Let's go. Um, <laughs> I'll be discarding nice. Seething Song, Worldly Tutor, Rending Volley, Cloudstone Curio, Food Chain, LED, right away. Hey, Food Chain buddies in the graveyard. <laughs> and everything but the colored mana. A Marsh Flax. Fetch. I'm going to get a Badlands. I'll do a Mana Crypt. A Foristic to three, which may sound a little two here. I'm going to dash in a Ragavan, floating one colorless from the Mana Crypt to pay Foristics. Yeah, I'll then do a white blue from Hollow Fountain for uh, attempt to play a Dranus Magistrate. Uh, trigger Ristic? I am not paying for Ristic this time. And move to combat, and I'll do Ragavan over at Cousin Two Chains, and I'll make a treasure. <laughs> All right, I'll untap. No Orcus Bowmasters to worry about, so I will draw the three cards. Um, yes, but... I'll put two okay. back. I'm not. I'm not gonna take any damage because I really don't want to take too much here. I'll play a Swamp, pay three to play a Mayhem Devil. You can draw. And then you'll also be able to draw from this because I cannot pay. I like to Imperial Seal. I'm going to Mental Mist up to Imperial yep. Seal in response to my Rustic Trigger. Imperial Seal is countered. And then Rustic Trigger, I'm good to go ahead and draw, you said? Yes. I will draw. I guess I'll swing three at Cousin to try to get the attack trigger to make another sapperling. Yep. Three slime footy damage. And then I'm going to pass the turn there. Untap, upkeep, draw. Did you draw land? <laughs> kind of feel bad. <laughs> Cavern of Soul. <laughs> All right, it's a land, I guess. Yep. Naming Goblin. Gob, ooh, here comes a dark side. <laughs> ooh. Uh, taking two, leaving one floating. Adding a red for a goblin. Dark side. You got a dark side. side. What the? <laughs> uh, I have a wrist trigger. Um, I will pay with the colorless. <laughs> what? I said, why do you have to be the way you are? <laughs> <laughs> So, 13? Yep. Okay. Doc's eating good tonight. Yeah, bro. Doc's eating good tonight. Yeah, he loves his treasures. Cast a Bergy. Got a Ristic study trigger on the Bergy. Oh, yes. Uh, Yeah, you can draw on that one. And then you sacrificed three treasures to cast Bergy? Yes. Oh, we have three. Ping both Doc's sides. Uh, so there, which There's, one are you killing uh, first, mine um, or Atali's? Because it's three treasures. So I feel like you might be one. more likely to clone, so I'll kill yours first and mark his dock site for one. You got it. I'll sacrifice my treasure and my lot lotus petal, and I'll sacrifice activating Brea, and I'm going to give, I'll give Brina minus four, minus four. And then I have three. And that reduces my heart. For the main Brina devil. Will, uh, yeah, I'll ping one at Dockside to kill off the Dockside, but I'll point the other two at Timna. Timna, go bye-bye. And then that's it for me. And then... Okay, Bergy results. Sack two treasures for two green. Two treasures. Uh, so I'll have two mayhem devil triggers. I'll go ahead and point those two right on to Brea. Okay. I just know what Brea has done to deserve this attention. <laughs> <laughs> Not um, with, my, with my two green and my one colorless uh, eternal witness. I will not pay. You may draw. Um, obviously, I know you've already uh, pointed to it, Brea, but I think we definitely should point some at 
Fergie, because I just don't know how much. Yeah, okay, I'll point the two damage at Bergy for now. I'll mark her at two. Okay, I'm going to get Cloudstone Curio back to my hand. Okay. Ooh. Yeah. It's that's another it. good choice. Yep. You have how many treasures left? Eight treasures, one four colorless, one red. Um, Tapping Grim Monolith for three, leaving one Loading. Actually, I'm going to pay for Ristic on this one. Okay. Uh, Cloudstone Curio. Trigger uh -huh. Bergy. Get another red. Got enough. Pass turn, all sad like. All right. Oh, Whew. Great. We live to fight another day, guys. Yeah, right, right. Uh, untap, upkeep. I will draw for turn. We're going to uh, play an exotic Orchard's Land for turn. Cast a Mana Crypt. This is good. Let's cast a J-Lo. Tap my underground C for a single black casting reanimate. Dark side, yep. Oh no. Oh no. <laughs> I've never seen so much mana yeah. come from these dark sides in one game. This is gross. I will lose two life. Holy moly. Seventeen, 17 oh. dark sides. What is this madness? I'll sacrifice eight treasures for red. Okay. Blue. I'm gonna sacrifice him for blue. Power move. I have <laughs> yeah, eight right? <laughs> mayhem devil triggers. Yep. My dark side is yep. on the stack, so you can't kill dark side again. So E witness is one, right? Yep. And then Bergy is four, three. Three. Yeah. So we'll we'll take those That's out. Dark ping. side resolve. Yes, I'll ping some of it at dark side, and then I have so two left. Have... Yep. I'll ping. I'll ping your face. Uh. So dark side. Uh, ETB back on the stack. Yep. One here. I make a whopping bunch of treasures. <laughs> still a good amount. It's still a good amount of treasures. You, it is three off of two chains. So that's four. And then how many do you have, Brea? That's oh, six, as compared so ten. to ten earlier. I think that's an improvement. Yeah, right. I'm going to sack two treasures. Two so mayhem double two triggers. On the stack. Yep. Are you going to be sacking any more, boss? Because I can put them on Brea then. Yes, I will be sacking. I'll put two on Brea. Okay, two damage. Uh, I would like to... Both of them are going to be for a white. I would like to put a green oh. demolisher on this. Crack a treasure for a black. I would like to hold priority. Okay, so the, with the trigger, I would respond and crack two more. So I would have uh, three have triggers. Two more. Yep. You have two on top of the one so the two on top will be for blue. well technically they're individual triggers you're right you're right um i would like to respond to those triggers using two blue to a born upon win all right so that'll resolve i'll draw the card back with the back to the triggers triggers on the stack Spawn to both of them, cracking. It's okay, so, so we have two more. I got five on the stack. I'd like to flash out a bowmaster. Bowmasters is good. I would like to point one target at Mayhem Devil. Okay, so Mayhem Devil has got a damage marked. And he's a three three, right? He is a three three. Respawn back to the triggers on the stack and use the black floating to cast an Imperial Seal. Lose two off of that. Still in response to the triggers, I would like to tap Mana Crypt for two colorless and tap my Exotic Orchard for a red and put a Wheel of Fortune on the stack. Oh lordy. Uh, so I have what, 21 triggers, right? Yep. Uh, so we'll wipe out, we'll put three of them towards Yep, the Mayhem Devil. Okay, Mayhem Devil. Many, you still have the five I triggers do. from Mayhem Devil on the stat. I do. Uh, so we'll do three. Uh, let's get rid of Dranith. That will be all that six. So that's six, yep. Let's hit Brea and Slime. So that's another four. So that's eight. That's 
two more. Oh, how big is Jace? Or how big is Slimefoot? Slimefoot is three. three. So, so in total, that's another five uh, triggers. So five triggers left. Let's do three of them at the, your orc army and one each at the sapperlings. Okay, so my sapperlings will also die. And then we're back to my five <laughs> measly triggers yep. that are... Yep. I think we go one at the bowmasters to kill it. How big is Grand Abolisher? A 2-2. Two, two. I think we go and we do two there. And then I yep. have two left. I think we just do your face, trying to keep okay. your life total pressured in case you do any of shenanigans. Sure. That was quite a turn of events there. Um, I would like to play a Flutter Strand as land for turn. would like to crack it. Uh, what land do I want? I guess uh, we'll grab a Bulk Island. Put an Underworld Breach on the stack. I would like to crack another treasure. Going down to one treasure. And cast a Gamble. Yep. Yep. Would you like me to still play it out? Gamble, go grab Brain Freeze. I did end up drawing into a Toxic, Fears, Adnaz, and Felt. Oh, jeez. Yeah, I figured hit your life total while I could. Yeah, no, 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 you are you were right. I, uh, the Imperial Seal was the Breach. Hmm. I Imperial Seal for the Breach to put it on top. Uh, that was definitely a great game, though. I definitely Yeah, that was... That was but very it, it screwed me up. back and forth. We hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, be sure to give it a like, share it with your friends, subscribe to our channel, and ring that bell so you don't miss any of our upcoming content. This episode was brought to you by our friends at Dragon Shield. We will be giving away some of our Dragon Shield sleeves. Be sure to use our Dragon Shield affiliate link in the comments below when you make purchases from Dragon Shield. Every little bit of support helps our channel keep growing.